So your chorus backing track uh, is going to go as follows, if you can call it a chorus. Um, and that just keeps repeating. That loop keeps repeating. Um, at the end of the chorus, once you've played that loop four times, there's uh, two chords you need to know. That is a F sharp minor chord. That's a G sharp minor chord. So if you were to put that together with F sharp in the left hand, and then G sharp in the left hand for the second chord, this would be your chorus. Now it's important that you remember this uh, little riff right here. Because the next part is going to pick up at the end of that riff. So, uh, remember that. So picking up where we left off at the end of that riff... is uh, So let's say you just played that riff. You're just coming to the end of that riff. This is in your verse. Your verse is going to continue. Instead of repeating it, you're going to go... Now I know it seems like a lot, the only, uh, the only thing I can help you with is that at the end, notice that when you get to this note, it's the same riff that you learned in the beginning. Just an octave higher. But uh, yeah, uh, not much else I can tell you except just play it over and over again and kind of build up the speed as you learn it. So putting together that fast moving part from your verses, along with the same left hand that we learned for the chorus, these are your verses. I'll play them kind of at a mid speed. Kiss by Bad Meets Evil. If you like these or any of the other videos you've seen on my YouTube channel, I'd like to encourage that you subscribe to it. And I'm always on the lookout for new songs to check out, new songs to potentially do lessons for, so if you have a song you want to learn or a song you're having trouble picking up, send it my way and I'll consider it for a future video. As always, I will see you next time. Ooh.